I know I just got the heart. <laughs> I just got it back anyway. <laughs> Hello everyone and welcome to Kaiser the Voices! I'm Kaiser Akron, the host of the Voices, and welcome back to Kaiser Plays The Binding of Isaac! Last episode, we have finally filled the negative. So this episode, we are going to do everything in our power to make what happens with that negative happen. Oh, and we've got the deck of cards as our very first item. Not bad, not bad. Okay, free tarot card, and it's the... <laughs> the fucking emperor of all the cards to get first the card that takes you straight to the boss and for some reason i thought those fat enemies were the stone ones so that's why i didn't move okay until this is gonna be up and hold on i get the sense that the game does not want me to get to the negative i get the sense that the game doesn't want this to happen with how aggressive it is being thus far Okay, either way, we're gonna do this. Ugh. After the success of last episode, I kinda need to deliver, you know what I mean? Like, I need to do good on this next one. I mean, you got a bomb, so. Bunk. What do we got? The world! Okay, so good to know that beyond the item shop is the secret room, which I can't access now because I bombed it. Literally, I, I used a bomb to open the freaking. Oh, this is gonna be a death. I'm gonna die in here, aren't I? Should I just die? Am I gonna die? I mean, if I die now, I can always restart the. Well, I guess I get to restart. <laughs> what the fuck? Well, that's a hell of a start. Death in five minutes. <laughs> Not even five minutes, more like five seconds. What happened? Okay, so disregard everything with that run. Editor, don't even put the thing for the item description. Just ignore that completely. What? Why did this room even need to be? All it was was a button press. What? Okay. Either way. <laughs> oh, this this is interesting. This is interesting already. Okay. Um. Well. I can honestly say I was not anticipating things to just get... I was not expecting to die first thing. That was... That, that, mm -hmm. that was a thing. If I get the reusable card deck again, I would laugh so hard if that... <sighs> almond milk. Fucking almond milk. You know what? Just because I feel like this is going to be interesting no matter what I do, I'll show you what it does. It takes your tears all the way up, your damage goes down to crap, and this is how you shoot now. Yeah. Do you see now why I didn't want to take it the first time? This is bad. Like, this is not good. Unless I get some damage, this item is going to screw over the entirety of the run. I got it so I could show you guys. But this is why I don't like this item. This item is unpredictable in its shooting. I mean, yes, it shoots decently enough, but it's not good. Like, at all. I don't like this item. Like, maybe if I got Libra, possibly. But yeah, no, um, I'm sorry. I don't normally do this, but I'm actually gonna restart. This does not count as a loss, by the way. This is me actively restarting the run so I can do better. So, a loss does not count on that. Let, let, let's make a new thing. We have wins, losses, and restarts. This is gonna go on a restart counter. Because I am actively choosing to not continue the run that I have just started. So, ergo, restart. Okay, Curse of the Blind. Means you can't see what item you're going to get. So, who knows what the fuck this is going to be? Tiny planet. Orbiting tiers. So yeah, everything just kind of goes in a circle now. Not the worst. This is actually a manageable item. Because at the very least, you can kind of predict the arc of where your tiers are going to go. And if you get a high enough tier rate, oh my god, this is, this is amazing to use. So... This could be workable. Like, this I will st I'll stick with. I will stick with this. Almond milk? No. <laughs> Not on your life. No freaking way. Like, I I take soy milk over this any day of the week. So, yeah. um, That's my stance on the almond milk thing. Great to drink, but terrible in the Binding of Isaac. I also forget that the tears do hit bombs, so that just happened. 
All right, let's go fight the boss. Who are we fighting? Pin. It's gonna be interesting with my tears. Oh, and it's a black pin. Basically means it spiral shoots instead of doing a bomb shoot. So that's that's different. Okay. Now I do love orbiting planet in the sense that it combos well with most weapons. Like most weapons you get in this game will combo well with um, the orbiting planet effect. Like for instance, the tiers obviously they they combine well. They go around in a nice little circle like little planets. And we get Jesus juice. All right, okay, not bad so far. I can accept that. Let's go. But yeah. Um, if I were to get, say, like, I don't know, Brimstone, for instance, like, just as an example, then the laser would actually go around in a circle before shooting straight forward. That is what I like. It, like, items that combo well with others. The other cool thing I like about Orbiting Planet is this. You can actually use its distance and arcing ability to play more evasive, I guess. Like, it, it makes you kind of work better with what you have, I guess. And did I seriously just get hearts and bombs from that? No complaints, that's good. What's not good is I don't have a key. And the game provides me with one, thank you. <gasps> oh, is that the good one? Is that the good one? Please tell me that's the good one. I mean, still technically good. I, I, I'm taking that, I'm taking that because either way, that's good. All right. So now I've got Virgo, which means I feel refreshed and protected. That means a shield will pop up if I take damage, which could be very useful in certain fights. So that, that, that works for me. Temperance. I don't want the blood donation machine. I really don't. Unless I have a shield, I don't want it. And yes, I could potentially make one, but I am not sacrificing my health to make that happen. Fuck that. No thanks. i rather freaking... Get a shield and then use it that way. The best way. Okay. I'm not even gonna dick with this. Okay. This, 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 bleh. I'm getting anything from this freaking floor. What the heck? Alright, let's keep moving. There's pills. Well, a pill, just two of them. If I had a bomb, I'd see what the first, like, one of the pills is, and then if it was good, I'd try to get a bomb to get the other one. But I don't have a bomb, so I can't really do that. I was so hoping the game would actually listen and give me a bomb just so I could do that, but no, unfortunately, that is not the case. I could really use an increase in fire rate just so I can get more tears floating around me. That'd be great right about now, is, uh, like, a barrage of tears. Like, honestly, the one item I think would work really well with this build is soy milk. Yes, I know I was just complaining about, like, almond milk and shit, but soy milk and this would actually be a good combo because it would create, like, this massive, like, line of tears that would actually be really useful. I combine that with Libra, which balances out everything anyway, and you actually have a very good item combination. I am sorry, Beggar, you're getting blown up. Sorry, buddy. All right, so Duke of Flies. This is a manageable boss. If I could get Devil Deal. If I could get Brimstone. I'd win. Like, I would automatically win just on principle. You fuck nut! Utter fuck nut! Of course, I take a hit from a bloody fucking fly. Piece of crap. Alright, come on. Fucking die already. <sighs> of course, I would take damage from a plebeian fly. Well, at the very least, it didn't take it all the way down, because I think that was the first hit of the floor, so I guess they're giving me some leeway. Maybe I'll still get the devil deal. Maybe I'll get lucky. That'd be nice. Oh, hey! Get my health right back. Awesome. Devil deal, please? Please? Yes! Okay. Cool. Got the devil deal. And that actually increased my tier rate. Awesome. De <sighs> no brimstone. That's okay, though. You know why? The Ockley Rift. And then I get this. And I'm still alive! And I got a damage buff. So you know what? Kinda worked out. Sweet. Okay. Not a bad run, but certainly not a good one. Like, it's middle of the road at the moment. I just gotta be careful not to take too many hits. That's all. 
Oh my god, I just realized the black hole effect of the fucking uh, ocular rift. This could be dangerous. It could be a very dangerous build I'm getting right now. Like, if I'm not careful, this could potentially royally screw me over. But at the same time, it could be very fun. Like, oh, I got Yes, I can see forever. That means I get secret and um, super secret for free. I don't have to bomb my way into them. Not bad. Okay, this run, not a bad one so far. I, I can work with this. I can work with this. I can work with this. Okay. Nice. Now then, let's uh, just play it safe. Thank you, Walk of the Rift, for helping me so very much right now. All right, there's the first secret. Good. Let's avoid the spiders. As honestly, I just kind of dance around my own tears. See, there's the Virgo effect. Get the shield. Nice. Well, that's a shitty one. Although it does get me into that locked room. It's probably a boss. No, it's the shop! Okay. Um, I have no complaints about that, so I'm going to take this. Key. Kind of wish I had a coin to get that soul heart, just because it would increase my health a little bit. Nice. If you'll... Stop the tears. Oh, fucking. Now, there's the super secret. So maybe in there will lie some riches of some description. Oh, wait, there's the coin. Never mind. Da, da, da. Never mind. Never mind. Take that. Maybe I'll get something good from the reroll. Uh, there's a red card that could be the Joker. If it's the Joker, I'd be so happy. Okay. Oh, almost got hit by that troll bomb. But I got enough coins for the freaking thing, so... Please? Please be Joker. Please? Two, Two of clubs. clubs. Okay, gives me a bomb. I won't bitch. I won't bitch. Okay, oh, I'm gonna bitch. I am gonna bitch about these assholes. I don't like these greed heads. Greed heads take your coins when you get hit by them. Don't like them. Don't like them. Don't like them. Not fun. So you can just ocular rift them to death. Game, that was your cue to drop an ocular rift. Game, you're... Okay, you're a little late, but I I I'll let it pass. <gasps> oh! Ramming speed! Nice! Okay, got a speed boost. Very nice. I I'm kind of... I'm kind of liking this run! Getting some interesting items. Only not complaining about the item placement. Good stuff. Okay. Wins in a bum. Boss. The dark one. Joy. At least I can hold him in place of the ocular rifts. I forget he has brimstone. Fucking bastard. You know, that'd be the item I'd really like right about now is fucking brimstone. As long as I stay out of the way of the brimstone laser, I should be fine for the rest of this fight. Whoa, 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 whoa. Almost screwed myself over there. Almost got hit by that. He did. I got a box of stuff. Cool, cool. Nice. Good stuff, good stuff. Give me that. Balls of steel. Not going to complain about that. Lazy worm, but... I, <gasps> <laughs> I love you. Fuck. I don't love it. Lazy Worm makes this... I am so glad I got Lazy Worm. I am... <laughs> okay. This just got interesting. Alrighty. Lazy Worm makes it go slow, which means it's easier to control, which means... Oh, this was a good catch. This was a good thing to get. I'm keeping this. This is nice. Because look, it's easier to control them. And then I'm able to just kind of go around in a nice circle and just kind of aim them. This lazy Worm actually kind of benefits this build. I like it. I like it a lot. And they stay in the air for a while, too. Ooh. This was a good item to get. Like, good trinket. Good trinket. Lazy Worm is good for this build. I like it. Shop. Oh, it's greed. It's a greedy bastard. But yeah, like, look. I can create a group of tiers and then just kind of run into things. Oh, you lost coins because of you. I lost more coins because of you. 
give them back to me and with interest, asshole. Well, at least it gives us a double deal chance. Alright. Gotta be careful. I don't have a lot of health left. If I can get a health-based item, that would help out. Unfortunately, not in this case. Because I am not in the room for that. Really hoping I can go to the shop, but unfortunately... Fucking greed took that away from me. <sighs> At least I'm getting money for it. At least I am getting money for it. I also love that the ocular rift here with this build, basically, once it hovers over something, it drops the rift. Like, kind of a cool way to handle that when you're orbiting. You're literally dropping a black hole on your... Thank you for the soul heart. You're literally just dropping a black hole on your way to freaking Painville, I guess. That, honestly, it is just kind of cool to admire the way Lazy Worm just kind of operates and slowly makes things... Mongo Baby. Okay, that, that's a that's a good follower. I can run with that. Now, if the Devil Deal gives me something really good, I might have to sacrifice my health for it. But only if it gives me health back, because you see, that's the trick with the Devil Deal. You gotta make sure you can get back what you put in. Whoa! Whoa! I was not in range of that shit. Okay, Ocular Rift, you can drop- I was about to say you can drop a black hole now! Okay... This is such a cool look. Seriously, or Tiny Planet is honestly just a really cool item to have. Okay. And very useful for situations like this. Alright. I'm getting keys up plenty. I mean, I'm not complaining about the keys, mind you. But it, it certainly, they are plentiful right now. This is what I'm taking notes of. And here's what I don't understand. Repentance has kind of done this thing where sometimes a boss room will have an extra room on the side? Why? What's the point? Oh, great. Polycyphilis. I don't like this boss. Really because of the unpredictability of the bounciness. I don't like that. Okay, you can die now. Go away! Thank you. The cards! What do we got? Some Hierophants. Strength card. Tower. Magician. The Emperor. Two of... Definitely taking that. <laughs> the Pact! That gives me health! So I, I knew I would stay alive because that gave me health. Totally didn't freak out there for a hot second because I realized, oh shit, I'm gonna die. I totally depend on for a second. <laughs> Justice! Thanks for the dime! Okay, what am I taking to down to the next floor? Um, the Emperor, so I can go straight to the boss after I clear the floor. Yes, that is what I'm going to do. Okay. This run is going kind of good. Ish. Another soul heart for me to stay alive. Thank you, game. You were, you were providing in spades, and I am so grateful for it. Now... I've done boss rush twice with Isaac. I ain't doing it a third time. Fuck you. Ain't no fucking way you're gonna get me to do that again. No way. The second time was a risk in and of itself. No way am I doing it a third time. No. No quit laughing at me, you fat bitch. Seriously. Laughs for everything. Just chuckles McGee over here. We got two of clubs. More bombs, even though it just multiplied by one. We got a dice room. So this could potentially be good or bad, depending on what dice number we get. If we get a five, that means I get to replay this floor and get another item. So let's see. Six! Reroll everything! Fuck you! No way. I like the build I have. What is this room? This is a... What kind of... Who thought of this room? Well, thank you, it's dropped me a lot of shit. I'm just... Damn. Look at my money. Look how much cash I have right now. Crawl space? Uh, that was random. So crawl space, they gave me some coins and keys. Well, that was a thing. Um, I was not expecting that, but... Cool? 
Let's go see what the item is. Little chub. Okay, um, that was good. The, 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 no, no complaints. Wait, no, that's infestation. That means when I get hit, I drop shit, right? I think. Don't remember off the top of my head. The editor will probably get that, which is me. I am my editor, so... Yeah. I hate these enemies. These enemies are a pain in my dick. Really, because they don't know when to friggin' stay up. Well, I love being able to do that. Pages is a virtue when dealing with those assholes. Okay. That. This. Where's the shop? Though it's kind of good I'm keeping the Emperor card. I can always use that in, like, the utero levels. So... Kinda glad I haven't used it yet. Alright, there's the shop. Orbiting planet has actually worked out quite nicely for me. Don't be super greed. Not super greed. Okay. Since last episode I accidentally bombed the donation machine, I'm gonna return money to it with interest. So, here we go. I'm gonna give this thing some cash. Really? Are you fucking serious? It stopped. Speed, speed up. up. That. I guess I'll just take this jar. It, it, it stores... Oh wait, that's the jar that stores health. I grabbed the wrong jar. Oh well. Maybe if I get a red heart based health item from the boss, it'll be useful. It's Loki. Little Loki. I forgot the Ocular Rift also kind of draws in the spike trap thingies. I do love it, just traps bullets from bosses and shit. That's so convenient. Okay. Well, I forgot you summoned bomb flies, you little bastard. Okay, just gotta... Pentagram! Damage! Yes! Oh! Uh, that's a death's list. Um... No! No, thank you. Take that heart, though. Okay. We're doing good. We're doing good. We're doing good. There's a dice room. It's D4, which rerolls me. Oh, health up. Means I can use this. Thank you. Fuck this room. <laughs> nope. Not even going to deal with it. Guppies. I know I just got the heart. <laughs> I just got it back anyway. <laughs> Fucking! I'm sticking with the. The, <laughs> the game is doing everything in its power to keep me alive! Oh my god, I love it! That's great! Oh my god! <laughs> that was an unexpected adventure! Oh, I didn't expect that to happen. Nope, nope, not at all. I am red in the face from that. Just. That transaction alone was worth it. That <laughs> was fucking funny. Oh my god. What is with this game doing the absolute most random ass bullshit? Like seriously, have you noticed in my runs lately, it just does the most random things without me even wanting it to? Like, what in the fuck? Oh man. That was crazy. That was utterly crazy. What's also crazy is I keep taking unnecessary damage from these freaking things. Little turret shooters. I don't even know what their names are. Ugh. Oh, okay. Got the brimstone from these Vis. Yes, that is their name. V-I-S. Vis. Vise. I don't know. I don't know how if you pronounce that or not. There's a little... There's worms in the floor in there. Yep. Fucking worms. Alright, there's the shop. That'd be nice. That tarot card deck generator thing. That'd be great to have right about now. Okay. Tears. Go away. Another soul heart for my travels. What do we got? Well, we got a soul heart. Another one. Okay, the death card. Mom's purse, which means we can store more trinkets. Yeah. We've got pink, pinky eye, which every now and again will shoot a poison shot. Not bad. Not bad. I, I, I will accept. 
Alright, there's the... There's the thing. The item room. Yeah, definitely into doing boss rush. I definitely ran out of... You! Again! I love it! My tier rate went down, but I've, now I've got a laser that just shoots. Great. I love it. This is... It's not brimstone, but you know what? It, it's good enough. It's good enough for me. This is a good run. This is honestly a really good run so far. <laughs> I'm hoping it stays that way. As we are now about to fight the mother ada 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 of pain. Hi, mom. You bitch. You, you bitch. I got a shield now, and I can just fucking do this. You eat that, you fat, full having motherfucker. Which, no offense to anyone who is chunky, I myself am. But she is like oversized chunky, you know what I mean? Like, she is that nasty chunky. And there it is, ladies and gentlemen. This is what we've been fighting for the negative. This changes everything and gives you debt. <gasps> <laughs> On top of everything else, Brimstone. <laughs> Not only do I have Leviathan, I have fucking Brimstone on top of everything else! This is the run! This is the run! This is the run where it's all fun! Whoop! Screw you, you fat fucker! You're about to die! Screw you, bloat! You... you are so fucked! I have Brimstone! You have nothing that can stop me now! <laughs> and because of Orbiting Planet, as I said, it just loops! Oh... I am happy. I am so happy. Oh my god, this is great. I don't even need Lacey Worm anymore. I'm just gonna keep this, keep that, and just go. Alright, next floor! Oh my god, I wasn't expecting this run to actually go the way it's going, but fuck it. I have decent damage. I have a transformation. Uh, I got... I'm doing good! This is a good run! Mm. Oh my god. Oh, playing as Isaac. Who would have thought? Fucking. I gotta do this with Eden. Like, I gotta have a good run like this with Eden. You know what I mean? Alright. <clears throat> Where's the boss room on this floor? Damn. Like, seriously, I just wanna find the boss and just destroy it. Well, at this rate, if I keep taking unnecessary damage, I'm gonna kill myself before I kill the boss. Oh, fucking A, man. I, I was not... I, I, I was hoping for Brimstone. I wasn't banking on it, but the fact I got it before going down to hell, the freaking womb levels, just... Wonderful. Wonderful. Oh, can't write a better freaking Cinderella story than that. Let's do it, bitch. Fight your heart. Oh my god, and thankfully because of the tears up I did get earlier, like, this brimstone charges up fast, so... Like, it doesn't take long to do, and even then, I've got a streaming laser thanks to Tech Point 2, or Tech 2, that just utterly decimates everything anyway. So, I win! Alright. Down we go again! Here we go! Alright, a fetus and a j- I've unlocked challenge 9. Okay! Alrighty. Okay, that room is empty. Let's- Fuck it, let's take a risk. Might as well, right? At this point, let's just have fun. Let's have fun. Because every time we've beaten the heart up at this point, it just means that, you know- Oh, I forgot those are the laser beams that just hit you from anywhere. Bastards. I hate those things. Alright, and these guys just decide to disappear and appear whenever, so... Be careful of them. They are a right pain in the ass. Yeah, I hate those little eye cloud thingies. Alright, at least that takes care of the flies in the room. Sodom's apple. Can fly through this. Kinda wish I didn't, cause now that wastes the heart. I'm gonna need a heart now. Oh great, two greeds! 
two Greedlings. Alright, got rid of one. That's that's one done. That's a one and done. Oh great. Okay, I might not be demonstrating the negative if I keep doing stupid shit like this. Unless a game wants to gift me some soul hearts, I'm screwed. <clears throat> some soul hearts would be great right about now. Please. Some soul hearts would be nice. I mean, I'm good on the, def uh, like, the evasive. But still, I would like the safety net of health. I don't think the game is listening. I think it stopped listening when it gave me brimstone. Alright. Gotta be careful. Unless this... No, oh, that's just an I found down spell. I... Oh! There's one! One is good! Two is even better! Okay, I have a chance. Great! <clears throat> Laser beam at the ready! Okay, just gonna get rid of you, and then both of you... Thankfully, Ocular Rift keeps you buckers in place. Now for Satan! Again! Come on, Satan, my boy. Oh, the freaking Ocular Rift proc right on top of him. Great! Oh, this is working out really well. Okay, okay, okay. So far, so good. We're doing good. We're doing good. We're doing good. Okay, there's his first foot. There's his second foot. Okay. Gotta avoid getting hit by the feet. And those little leech thingies. Really don't like those things. They explode, by the way, so be careful of that. Oh, I hit both feet that time. That was great. Okay! Zane's dead again! And now, we get to demonstrate the effect of the negative! Because we're not done! Welcome, one and all, to the dark room. And it's Curse of the Blind, so I don't even know what half of these items are, and it doesn't matter. We are now in... Literal hell. Like, this is adjacent to hell as we're gonna get. Essentially, welcome to boss mode. And I say that because basically now we're just fighting a bunch of bosses. To try and find the main boss of this area. That's who we're, our main focus is. So let's hope and pray I can get through this. But this is the new end goal for our runs. Oh, hello. Please be something good. Right, it's an item. The hourglass. Temporary enemy slowdown. That's actually useful. I'll take that. Oh, fucking. Definitely using that now. I can deal with the bloat and this bullshit. Yeah, staying on the side of this bloat means you're gonna get shot with brimstone lasers. Not a very nice thing to do. Excuse me. Oh! Oh! That patch of dirt's gonna be important way, way later. Trust me. I, I promise you that's gonna be a very important patch of dirt. I know that sounds very weird. Just trust what I am saying here right now. That patch of dirt is gonna be very, very important later. Good thing I didn't touch any of those, because I don't know what they are. And if any of them kill me, that would suck. Because I've gotten very far on a very, very good build. And I don't want to lose that. Okay. Trying to stay alive as I fight two war horsemen. Literally, they're both war, so. They're the war horsemen. Here's the freaking boss room! Oh, great. Woo! I don't like you. I don't like you. I don't like you. I don't like you at all. I don't know. One. <laughs> Thanks for the full health, but I have only one heart, you dits. <clears throat> don't know if I'm gonna beat this. I have one heart of health. I have very low expectations of this. Unless the game gives me some soul hearts, I don't know if I'm gonna... Oh, I really don't feel like I'm gonna survive this. Oh, nope, there it is. There it is! Damn it. Well, at least we got to the dark room, we unlocked some stuff, so... Mission somewhat accomplished. It's a positive. I, I will take it. But next time, we are beating the Dark Room. So tune in next time as we venture deep into the Dark Room again to hopefully beat the boss that awaits us. But at least I showed it and showed what to expect. So till then, thank you all so very much for watching. If you enjoyed this, please leave a like and a comment in the boxes below. Let me know your favorite moments from this episode. 
Also, be sure to subscribe, hit the notification bell, and make sure all notifications are turned on. That way you know when I am delving deep into the darkness of the dark room. Also, share this video around to continue viewership and support. It's greatly appreciated. And of course, a very special thanks to the Tier 2 and Tier 3 Patreon supporters. Those being... Five Way Dragon, Boss Maker, Carmelo Sun, D Wolf 1414, Hizuno Corento, Honor Higgins, Jesse Barbo 6, Mighty Chlorophyte, Nagi Oki, Vio Serra, Seth Ryan Dodson, Sonic Destroyer 12, Sonic Star 21, Brianna Onseo, Darshan Morris, Azuka 610, Mimi Peach, Prince Fenbone, Booby the Wolf, Silver Fox and C, William Christopher Warren, and Tim and Recluse. If you'd like to support the Patreon family, as well as get videos 24 hours in advance, exclusive Let's Plays, and a chance to do Let's Play for this channel, check the link in the description below to our Patreon. And with that said, this has been Kaiser, and I'll see you all next time. Bye bye!